Product design at Brighton enables students to develop practical, creative and critical skills so that they can dream up, test and communicate new products, experiences and interactions. What's exciting about product design is that it's a way of intervening in the world, of making things that allow people to do things. It's about so much more than making things that are for sale in the shops. It's about intervening in systems, processes. It's about creating new ways of living. Any design activity and thought uh, has the potential to enable um, ideological purpose and expression. I think now is perhaps one of the most exciting times to be a designer and that's in large part due to the role that technology is playing in the world. It helps us to connect to our environment, ourselves and to others. Designers uh, have uh, probably now more than ever uh, a role in social transformation. There's a special type of designer that comes out of Brighton and I think that's one that has a real respect and understanding for society, for social issues, for environmental issues, for the challenges that we all face. ProDesign also gives you the ability to think quite critically and develop a point of view about the kind of designer that you are and the identity that you'd like to have going through to industry. Product design as a discipline has to go beyond the physical object. And in some cases where an application or a service is the solution to the problem where it's not object-centric, designers have to have a much broader skill set. So I think the fact that it's so open is probably what's most exciting about it. Brighton's a fantastic place to live, work, study. It's full of interesting, exciting people. It's full of people who care about what they're doing. And there's always something happening. The university itself also has a lot to offer in terms of societies and activities that you get involved in. And Brighton as a city is really fun, it's really exciting, and there's always loads of events going on. Just a, this sense of family and belonging in Brighton that is really, really special. It's such a nice place to be. Through the use of the workshops, digital production facilities, and through the Fab Lab, we give students the ability to prototype, to test out, to create looks like and works like prototypes. We try to give students the confidence to use a wide variety of tools, everything from digital fabrication tools for prototyping through to digital service design tools. We want to give them the ability to integrate a wide variety of skills, including a user-centred design process, empathy for people, and also design engineering, a sense of aesthetics and style, and the ability to develop their prototypes through making. This course gives you the ability to take a concept or a piece of research and go through the whole design and production process straight through to a final finished model that you can feel really proud of. A particular feature of the product design course at Brighton is that we teach in what we call vertical studios. And this sees students in their second year working really closely alongside students in their final year. Through having such a diverse studio culture and one that is evolving year on year, it means that the product design course can be really dynamic and that the students have a really strong voice in shaping the course. The Vertical Studios has been divided in different thematics, uh, so students will be able to experience different approaches. Looking at things like makerspaces, digital fabrication, local materials, open design um, as ways of changing how supply chains work. So our students don't just look at products and we encourage students to look at the whole system. I'm interested in the role that designers uh, can play in the resolution of uh, issues of social nature. I also like having taught in studios so the course is broken up into different aspects of product design and you can choose your studio based on your own preference and makes it more suited to your design identity. I was also able to gain experience during my placement year which taught me a lot about the design industry in general and helped me to grow as both an individual and a designer. You never feel uncomfortable, you never feel like what you're doing, you know, isn't good enough because there's always that support structure behind you that makes sure that Whatever you're doing, you're doing it to the best of your ability. The work we do in the studio is inspired by our practice, Other Today. Other Today is located in the world of distributed design and explores its potential to reduce the environmental and 
the social impact of manufacturing. I also like the fact that we have our own physical um, studio space, so you can come in, you can work, you can socialise with other product design years, and it makes it feel much more like a community than just a place where you can just sit down and get work done. It's about understanding the world. It's about interacting with its physicality, the processes, systems, ways of being. It's about creating a new world. And chess. Brighton is an amazing place. The acceptance they have for everyone and everything is something that makes Brighton really, really special. I've really loved my time at uni. I've made lifelong friendships. I've really enjoyed the subject I've been studying. And I've had the absolute time of my life, which I now really don't want it to end.